assalamu alaikum dear students today we are going to discuss about open and closed sets so in this video you will learn what are open sets what are closed sets uh, sets that are both open and closed and the sets that are neither open nor closed so let's move toward open sets if we let set x and ta be a topological space and u be a subset of x then this u is called open set or open subset of x if this u belongs to ta like uh, whenever we take the open subset of x it means that that subset uh, is basically from topology ta whenever like uh, uh, all the subsets that belongs to ta are called open subsets and uh, now we will take the example uh, if we let that x equals to a b c d e like we have uh, taken the space which contains five elements and if we take the topology ta to be uh, ta equals to phi x singleton a c d a c d b c d e be a topology on x then uh, the open sets uh, subsets of x are phi x a C D A C D B C D E. Ah, uh, here all the su uh, subsets that belongs to Ta are called open subsets of X. Next, move toward closed set. So closed uh, set is basically if we take a topological space X of Ta and we take the subset U subset of X, then this U is called closed subset of X. If u complement belongs to ta like here in this case we have to take the complement of open sets or in other words we can say that uh, we have to take the complement of the members of ta and that complement should belong to ta then we will say that the set is closed set uh, here we will discuss the example of closed set here x uh, uh, we have taken the space x to be a b c d e and we have taken the topology ta to be phi x singleton a c d a c d b c d e and this is the topology on x then the closed subsets are if we take the complement of phi it is x if we take the complement of x it is phi we we'll take the complement of a we will get b c d e we we'll take the complement of c d we will get a b e we we'll take the complement of a c d we will get b e we we'll take the complement of b c d e we will get singleton a and these are closed subsets of x next we will discuss sets that are both open and closed here uh the sets which are both open and closed are called clopen sets so uh phi and x are both open and closed sets here in previous example you see that if we uh, phi and x always belong to type means phi and x is always open now check whether it is clo always closed or not in previous example we took the complement of phi and we get x similarly we uh, took the complement of x and we get phi and phi and x it means uh, that phi and x are both open and closed similarly in case of discrete topology every open set are also closed like uh, whenever we take the complement of any member of ta we will get an other member of ta and that is uh, all which is also open set so we can say that in case of discrete topology every open set is also closed set now we will discuss uh, the sets that are neither open nor closed so if we let that x equals to a b c d e and consider a topology phi x a c d a c d b c d e your topology then if similarly if we take uh, the subset u a b c 
and this is a subset of x so we have to check that uh, either it is open or closed or neither open nor closed so first of all we will check it is open or not since it doesn't belongs to ta here abc is not in ta it means that it is not open so now we will check whether its complement belong to this ta or not if we take the complement we will get x minus u and x minus u is equal to d and d doesn't belong to ta so it means it is also not closed so we conclude that u is neither open nor closed so that's all about our today's lecture good luck and allah peace